and that like spicy cinnamon woodsy note. Oh my goodness, baby, that is just so sexy. Ooh. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have another exciting fragrance review. Today, we are talking about Zerzhoff's Overture. This baby, who we have, well, I have so much to say. If you guys would like to hear my thoughts and opinions on this lovely stunner, then please keep watching. First off, if you're watching this video and you aren't subscribed, Go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and subscribe. I love talking about fragrance, beauty, everything beauty related, lifestyle. Uh, and while you're at it, go ahead and click that like button or the dislike button, it's all the same. And drop me a comment down below. Most importantly, let me know what your scent of the day is. I have a feeling I'll be spraying this little stunner. So let's quickly get into the review. Okay guys, so first I have to tell the story about how I even came across this beauty. So this is Zerzhoff's Overture and I received a sample from my beautiful friend here on YouTube, Jess. I will link her channel down below. And I will also... <coughs> <coughs> Devil! <laughs> And I will also link the video where I first tried this, you all. I mean, you already know, if you've seen my fragrance reviews, when I smell something and I throw my head back and start screaming, that means it's a winner. This was the first scent that I've ever smelled, tried, held anything from Zerzhoff. I know that Zerzhoff creates amazing masterpieces and this is definitely nothing far from such. So now let me give you guys a little background info on Zerzhoff's Overture. So this is a unisex scent for men and women that was launched in 2019. The nose behind this is the perfumer Chris Maurice, a beautiful fragrance that's categorized as an amber floral. This can be purchased from Saks Fifth Avenue, Neiman Marcus, uh, probably other various retailers. But I purchased mine from Joma Shop because I saved about 50%. And you will always know if I can snag a deal, She's going to snag a deal and saving a hundred or $150, uh, that's worth it for me. These bottles come beautifully packaged. Now I didn't save my packaging because I just don't have space for things like that, but the presentation was exquisite. I mean, look at the bottle. You already know that the presentation was exquisite because the bottle is as well. Now I would have to say that this is one of the more unique fragrances in my collection. It mixes spicy notes with sweeter notes. And most of the spicy fragrances that I do have or even have tried mix spicy and soft or like vanilla but this is a spicy fruity like floral and that's something that I don't see all too often but when I tell you baby she is a stunner. First I want to share my first impression of this fragrance and how other people took it. Mm. If you've never tried Zerzhoff fragrances, definitely experience them. Go to Neiman Marcus, go to Saks, because the level of detail in the bottles and in the fragrance and the notes is just amazing. First of all, the concentration of oil, like my hand has a sheen on it, just amazing. So, our first impression, I get a very spicy note of cinnamon. And then I get floral, maybe jasmine, definitely rose a musky note, maybe like incense and maybe a little vanilla, maybe some amber. This baby is what I refer to as sexy holiday. And when we say holiday, we're talking like summertime vacation, nighttime musky, sw like sweaty in terms of it's hot outside, like sex appeal. This is a masculine of center sense. This is not something that's super, super feminine. And while it does have floral notes in it, I'll put the notes across the screen. It's overwhelmingly spicy and sweet. And when I wear this around people, they become close. Men love this. They will eat you up. This scent is a magnet. Not only is it a man magnet, it's just a people magnet because it's so intense. This is just amazing. It reminds me of being outside in the summer. I would even wear this in the fall time. It's sexy. This is just sex appeal. It's summertime at night, sex appeal. The way this radiates, 
on your skin as you heat up. That's why I say it's a good scent for summer. That spice note just shines so brilliantly. And when I tell you this is a head turner, people are going to want you to come lean in because it is that amazing. And the way that the notes are blended, it's just like, it just, I just wanna wrap my body in silk. Like this is a masterful creation. Now, let's talk a little bit about the sillage and longevity. The sillage or like how the scent radiates. I would say this, on a scale from one to 10, I would give it about an eight. When I sprayed this scent and walked downstairs in my home, everyone in my home was like opening doors to see what I was wearing. I mean, this is a showstopper. As you can see, when I talked about how I sprayed it and there was a lot of oil on my hand. The concentration of parfum in this is amazing. This is a scent that's going to last and la it's a make it last forever. It's definitely one of those scents and that's also why I think it works so well in the summertime. It definitely has a great sillage without being too, too offensive. And with longevity on a scale from one to 10, I would give it about an eight. It doesn't have the best longevity out of any scent that I've ever tried, but it's definitely not moderate either. It lasts a nice amount of time. And if you spray it on your clothes, which I would be hesitant about if it's a darker fabric I would do so it lasts even longer this is one of those scents that you can spray on at five go out to dinner continue enjoying yourself that night and you will still smell it on you and it will just oh something about this it's just you know how I say Talea is my like <laughs> expensive holiday vacation but very beachy this is the nighttime version it's sexy it's very androgynous it's still a little sweet but it doesn't smell like coconutty fresh and beachy it just smells like opulence at night oh and that like spicy cinnamon woodsy note oh my goodness baby that is just so sexy Ooh. Ultimately, do I think this fragrance is worth it? Do you need this fragrance? Who is it for? Is it worth it? Absolutely. Honestly, if I had paid $300 for it, I would still think it's worth it because the way this is blended is so masterfully. I mean, it's just smooth. You know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of sipping cognac out of a glass. I mean, it's just smooth. It's smooth, it's sweet, it's spicy, it's sexy, it's intense, it's very androgynous. This is the type of scent that I definitely go for. While I do like feeling and looking very feminine, I mean, today I'm wearing an off the shoulder top. I love juxtaposing that with something sexy, deep and intense, and this is that baby. I definitely think if you love a spicy floral scent that is very androgynous and just smooth and amazing you would love this it is not going to be everyone's cup of tea but I think out of the Zerzhov scents that I have at least explored online I think this might be a safe blind buy as long as you like a sweet spicy fragrance I'm so glad I have my first Zerzhov scent I definitely have others on my list that I would like for fall and winter Whew. Just amazing. You know when I start screaming about fragrance that I really, really love it. And I'm going to spray this as my scent of the day because baby, when I tell you, this is just something that, oh, oh my goodness. Mm. Wow, this is a beast. Yes, Zerzhov, yes, yes, yes. So definitely check this scent out if you've been in the market. If you are looking for your first Zerzhov scent, this house overall has really unique creations that are masterfully blended. And if you are not into something very unique, strikingly bold, you may not like the house overall, but if that's your type of vibe like it is mine, I would definitely say uh, look into Overture. This is one of the more popular scents of the line and I will be wearing this all fall because <sighs> you get, you're gonna get eaten up in this, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you for watching. If you have any comments or questions, feel free to leave them down below. Let me know if you've tried this fragrance or if you've tried multiple Zerzhoff fragrances, what is your favorite? For me, she is everything. I love you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye.